kid ain't finished here yet. Oh, it's true, I'm not. Soul's travels ain't much compared to what the kids had to go through for all this. So let's build a lost and found. The Do lost and found. Stop. Here, kid takes fragments of the old world and makes them whole again. Plush pith. Oh, we were supposed to get that in uh, the pith orchard. So as you can see, we have all of these spirits that we can buy, as well as all of these upgraded items. Uh, and we have even a couple of uh, special moves that we can buy. Graver Slash, I've never, I've never seen that used. Or Final Warning, I've never seen it either. Um, but what I do know is that we always need something sharp. All it takes is some fragments, and the Bastion makes it good as new. And something coarse, why not? And then just for the sec sake of storyline, this the plush pit. So let's go talk to to Rux about the plush pit. The Ura feared the gods. We turned them into toys, put their faces on our walls. Talk to Zolf about it. Zolf doesn't touch the thing. Says the god of commotion is no children's toy. There we go. Seems the only thing the calamity saved for Zolf was his smoking pipe. So we got this guy. We can rotate him. Turn him round and round all you like. Pith's still gonna be ugly. Ah, I think that this is a beautiful steam bowl. All right, let's go. Let's go check on these. So we have a couple things that we can do. If we have the sail hammer, deliver a single crushing blow to a foe for at least 70 damage. We're, we need upgrades for that. Basically. You have all these different things that you need to do in order to obtain these. I don't know what we had to do to obtain this one, but we apparently did it already um, because our vigil is completed. Defeat three foes with a single well-timed power shot. We've done that before. We can do that now if we really wanted to. So let's just uh, head over to the arsenal and let's switch out the scrap musket for... Actually, what do we need to do with the scrap musket? Anything survives a musket shot ought to be quick work for that blade. It's true. Uh, defeat ten or more foes in a single well-placed shot. We will probably do that later. So, let's grab the Breaker's Bow. Alright. And so let's take up the Ford, something sharp. Uh, so, we can actually add more damage over time and cripple, or we can do another 20% critical hit chance. Um, stacks with keen edge. Okay, well, I didn't need to know that. Um, let's go ahead and get more cripple. Points just don't get any sharper than that. Oh, you shouldn't have said that. Now I need to make it sharper. And then something coarse is the upgrades for the scrap musket. Oh, I need to sneeze. Ah, <laughs> uh, excuse me for that. All right, so we've got a few more proving grounds. We've got the Bullhead Court, which is actually the Bullhead Shield proving ground. We've got Langston River. We've got the Scrap Yard, and we've also got Zolwood Grove for uh, the musket. So let's actually do the musket one right now. Why not? Ever felt a Zolwood Gourd like picking up broken glass barehanded? As Zolwood Grove, marshals learn to make every shot count. All right. So the trick was to pop all those nasty gourds without wasting ammo. So the way that you want to do most marshals this, didn't get far on the first few tries. Is you want to move all of them towards the edge. Had to catch a bunch of those gourds in a single shot. Funny thing about muskets is they work best up close. Yep. Oh, we got three more. Okay, so can we get them all in one shot? We can. It took a keen eye, not an itchy trigger finger. So how many shots did we need to get first prize? Fifteen shots. Oh my god. Alright, uh, something coarse, 
something foul. Why don't we do this one more time, see if we can get 15 shots. If Kid not, we'll leave it there for today. Time for just him and his favorite musket. It's my only musket. Alright. We're doing good so far. Plenty of gourds to go around, even now. Okay, that one didn't go anywhere. We can actually get knockback upgrades if we wanted to make this any easier for ourselves. Um. Marshals like to fine tune their muskets. Oh, we results. just beat it. The best of the best to clear the course in just a few shots. There we go. Scrap salvo. So let's go ahead and run up to the skyway. Kid probably could have made himself marshal one day. Hey, welcome back. We're in the bastion. Squirt friend. Uh, right where we left on, off. Give the little tiger break. Oh, you're talking about Zulf or are you talking about the squirt? I don't know. All right. So let's head into the forge. As you can see, we have all of this different stuff. Um, the thing with the scrap musket is there is a lot of positive negative trades off in here. So uh, you have plus 50% range, but you have minus 50% spread. So basically the difference between a tight shot and a wide and a wide shot. Then you also have more spread, less range. So uh, we're actually not going to do anything about that because we've already passed the the scrap musket proving ground if you guys were here last time so we've got our trusty uh, war machete and breaker spell we've got the lost and found uh, just to remind ourselves we need three foes with a single well timed power shot in order to get this vigil so let's try and do that next uh, next course so our only course that we have an option of doing right now is the Langston River, so let's go ahead and do that. Loading up. The Langston River flowed free and wild till the calamity drank it all up. Alright, so we are introduced to Maybe a new enemy in this water area. Just grew wings and flew off. Right. I hate stab weeds so so much. Oh, what's over here? There's stuff over here. Yay. Ow. Alright, let's stop knocking around. Riverbank swarming with windbags. Took that guy out easy. Probably so not on finding the core, they hardly notice the kid. Probably not our best moment to Lucky bring for a bow. him, a certain famous fairy barge is still afloat. Alright. Weepin' Nelly. She sends some squirts crying home as she leaves port. Maybe Nelly knows the way to the core. Maybe she can slip right past all the clamor on the coast. Or maybe not. Uh-oh. A security skiff pulls up port side. Nelly's just another windbag to those guns. Windbags are not made of wood in my... Just then, the windbags notice who she's sailing with. They're pretty steamed about what happened at Cinderbrick. Uh-oh. They remember. That's not good. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. They try to cut her off. Ooh, almost flew off the edge there. Is that fire? That's a fire turn, isn't it? No. No, no fire. They try to slow her down. Oh, bye. Just rolled off Nelly. They try to knock her out. Alright. Uh oh. Don't hit that. Well, Weepin' Nelly tries harder. Little pecker over there. Try as she might, though. She hits a snag. 
Uh-oh. Kids gotta help me get untangled. Favors for favors. Alright. So we should pick a good stuck. spot for a break. Oh. The core's right there. Hey, hey, hey. Okay. Let's do ourselves a favor and switch up to the scrap must be coming up here. Oh, for Christ's sake. Go home! Go home! Damage over time, haha. -ha. So we've got the coal war. Then the kid hears an unusual sound, like a hundred flapping wings. There we go. Peckers. See now why I brought the musket. Because these things like to fly everywhere, and we need as much of a spread as possible. What is that noise? Like, what, what is that noise? I don't like that noise. It sounds like when something gets stuck in a wall in Minecraft. They've been watching us every move. Oh, they've been attacking they the They had their own eyes on the core. But why? Well, kid ain't got time to think it over just yet. <laughs> They're fighting windbags. He finds a weeping Nelly raring to go. And we've got some Turns friendly turns. Turns out she's turns. got a special surprise for when the waters get rough. Here we go. She's gonna need a little help with all them peckers. Traffic things think they're king of the roost now. The rest of us only wish we could fly in times like these. <laughs> Just tried to shoot the turrets. I forgot about them. No. No. None of you. None of you. Ain't no one fucks with Weepin' Nelly. Ain't no one. Security skiffs keep on coming, starboard side. These are the homing ones, aren't they? Don't seem to care what they shoot, as long as they hit something. Go away! The windbag's getting even better there. idea. They aim to smash Weeping Nelly to splinters. Do not smash Weeping Nelly. Kid almost falls again. Well, almost all falls. proves too much for poor Nelly. No! No! Nelly, stay with me! She's just gotta make one last stop. No! With her last breath. Nelly gets the kid to solid ground. Solid ground in Pecker country. They want that core real bad. Seems a calamity ain't hurt the Pecker's appetites. Don't make me hurt you. You don't like it when I hurt you. The kid shoes him off, knowing they'll be back. Know how many times kid nearly fell off the barge back there? Yes. Three times. <laughs> it was counting. Now, listen close. You should remember this next part. Alright. Where'd we Why land? Why go to Prosper Bluff? Ah, Prosper Bluff. Used to take an enterprising man, or a plain old fool, to venture out that far. Good now? Oh, oh no, you're you're very weak. Okay. The city was the most beautiful place in the world. We all knew that. Alright. Oh, uh, bridge dropped. But on the other hand, 
Some folks just yearn to see the things they're told they can't. Some men just want to watch the world burn, is basically what he's saying. So those have noxious fumes, if you run through them, they... Basically make then that's why you go to Prosper Bluff, ain't it? Excuse me for a moment. We're back now, my father had to call me in the middle of it. Alright, get out of here. Get out of here! Alright. So where are we looking here? They're the kid here, something he ain't heard in a long while. And the bridge collapses. Sky Bridge. How's it go again? One of the most famous songs from this entire game. Yeah, that's the one. So now, another interruption, my dogs are fighting in the other room. <laughs> no, I told you not to do that. Oh man, they're loud. Alright. Alright, we're back. Let's go ahead and finish up this area uninterrupted. Un uh, this is, uh, uninterrupted. Uh. You know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. Jeez. Stop it with the whole flying back and forth thing. It's really annoying. Oh no! Ah! Oh! I needed that. No. No. No peckers. Women only. Get out of here. What's over here? Ooh. Five of those fragments. Alright. So we need to find another switch. Get out of here. Yeah, here. Okay, so we can't recover from those. Oh, come on! I always need health tonics. Why are you launching me over here? Oh, because we got a bridge over here, okay. So we need another switch, which is probably down this road since the only way we can go. No, none of that. Ow. No, no, no. Hey, 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 hey. You don't like it. You're not gonna like it. You're not, you didn't like it, did you? Of course you didn't. I warned you. You heard me. So you can see actually the reload bar down here every time I fire it. That's how long it takes for me to do that. You can upgrade the reload speed. Oh, things are falling apart. We are very well. Well, no point explaining what happens next, right? Found the Suffice jerk. it to say, kid ain't coming home empty handed. I don't like that though. And besides, it's like the song goes. They'll be here before too long. <laughs> 